Welcome to the flip side, and welcome to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved, where, oh, I just got an email on my phone. That, that's what that was, because I'm super prof professional and turn my phone on silent when I'm recording. But today is a wonderful day, because it is uh, Thursday? Thur Thursday, and I love Thursdays almost as much as every other day of the week. So what we're going to be doing today is we have to get ourselves a preserving bin. All right, because look at all this delicious food and this honey, which I quite literally died for. So we got to do, got to put that somewhere or else what, what was the point? Huh? That's what I want to know. So we got to level up. How far away are we from? Oh, we're going to look. That's interesting. That worked out really, really nicely. All right. Let's go get our preserving bin, which I think is boom, baby. What are any fiber stone thatch wood? Booyah. Okay, let's get that. I think this is gonna give me is this gonna give me metal? Yes, it is. I don't I don't need the metal yet. I don't I can't build anything with it's fine. I'll just collect it. Right, how much stone did I need for that? I wasn't paying attention. And I don't have my axe anymore. I need to rebuild it. I need to I need to repair my axe. Okay, first of all, why the heck have I not had a torch this whole time? Okay, that's that's just that's just silliness is what it is. Um, all right, so let's put the torch down there and put the stupid sparkler on there so it gets out of my inventory. All right, now let's look at the preserving bin. We need 30 stone, 10 thatch, and some amount of <laughs> wood also. <laughs> Sounds good to me. So let's just grab, I think it was 20, was it 20 wood? Oh, oh man, why do I even look at the recipes? Because I look at the recipes and then immediately forget. I need to focus on like one ingredient at a time. Okay, 30 wood and 30 stone. Okay, one more, I need one more, thank you. All right, and now, can I get stone? I'm not really gonna get it from hitting it with a pickaxe. What if I punch it? Is this, does this rock not exist? What, what the heck? Oh, did I get enough? Oh, <laughs> I need one more stone. Let's just grab it right there. Perfect, love it. So now we can make our preserving bin and get all the stupid food out of our inventory, which is just driving me bananas. All right. Oh, man. If only there was bananas. Is there bananas in this game? Because if there isn't, there should be because they are rich in potassium and deliciousness. All right. We'll put the preserving bin right next to the fire. Oh, look at this wonderful thing that we've built. Okay. So let's just throw all of this deliciousness love it and all the honey and the eggs love it G give me some spark powder throw this in there boom is it on there we go man and to think that took me probably 20 plus episodes <laughs> to figure out what the preserving bins were used for but now we got it and we're and we're rolling lars you got inside i'm not sure I'm not sure how I feel about that, but you know what? We will do our best when it comes to leaving the house. All right. Because I know you, dude. I know how much you like to get stuck and not leave the house. But this house is important to you, just like it's important to me. And, you know, I could appreciate that. All right. Do I have any more Ingrams? Oh, heck yeah, I do. You freaking kidding me, dude? Let's get some shirts and some shoes. Because if you don't have shirts or shoes, you don't get any service. At most establishments, at least. No shirts, no shirts, but you get service. Why shoes? Oh, yeah, but you guys remember that song? Gosh, that was like the only song that they would play at like school dances or events. I never went to a school dance, actually. I've been to a singular school dance, and it was because I was nominated to be Winterfest King, and. I lost, I came in second place, but I was required to go to the to the event, to the dance, uh, and so I went and took the photos that I needed to take and uh, then danced with a girl and then I cried a lot and then I went home. Yeah. So, great memories, man. Thanks, thanks for bringing that up, guys. All right, so let's throw that in there. Perfect, look at me. Oh my gosh. I am a hide-covered caveman. Perfect, love it. Um, who, who's pooping in the house? I love you. Oh, is it you? Oh, it's okay. You can poop anywhere you want, dude, because you're my best friend. 
All right, let's get rid of all this crap. Why? Because I don't want it. You should, you could be saying, Jacob, that could be useful. And I'd be saying, hey, shut up. Um, okay, let's go. Is this my fiber? Is this my, I need signs. That's what I need. I need some signs. i right, throw that in there. My thatch. Love it. Okay, but actually, I actually I need something, guys. Um, I need a pickaxe. But how much longer till I can make the workbench and start making my metal stuff? Oh, it's the next level. Heck yeah, dude! We are just flying through. I'm gonna go kill something. How's that sound, guys? You wanna kill something with me? Let's go. Let's go. Or we could tame a turtle. Hmm. Probably should try to tame something. All right, let's go. Let's go tame that bird. Even though I can't ride it for like another ten levels. Okay, let's try to. Ah, oh, dang it. I sh Lars, I really sh I should have I should have left you, dude. I should have left you. I mean, I love you. I love you. Yes, I do. But you just kind of in the way, man. All right, and I mean that with the most love that a dad could possibly say to his child. All right, sorry, Henry. I just I need to pick up some rocks. Okay, I'm a rock collector. Actually, speaking of rock collection, I used to actually collect rocks, like in real life. That was a thing that I really enjoyed doing. Um, I would just pick up rocks and then bring them home to my house. And one thing that I really liked to do was I would take rocks and then bring them to my front yard. And then I would uh, smash them with hammers just to see the way they exploded. I think it was awesome. I still think it was cool. Sarah thinks it's a little bit weird, but you know what? Sarah's a girl, and girls typically aren't uh, as into smashing things with hammers as, as I am, okay? And so I can't say I blame her for thinking I'm a little bit of a weirdie, uh, but <laughs> I don't think she's ever actually smashed something with a hammer, and if she had... She may change her tune a little bit is all I'm saying because there is something very satisfying about taking something that is completely normal and then smashing it with a hammer into tons of little pieces. It just feels barbaric and awesome. Okay, you guys can just hang out out here. All right. Trust me, you're better off. All right, so let's get some spark powder going on. We'll throw the rest of our flint in here. And we're just we're just gonna keep on collecting this metal until the metal runs out of the what was that? Thought I heard something. Maybe not. Maybe I heard nothing. Or maybe I heard everything. Hard to tell sometimes, really, if we're being honest. Because my head is pounding right now. It's uh either a headache, a migraine, or potentially a heart attack. I'm not sure. Uh, if somebody wants to flip a three-sided coin and let me know, that would be awesome. Or if you're a doctor, for example, Alejandro, if you want to just shoot me a DM and let me know if I'm dying or not, that would be uh, that would be tip or topper. All right, so let's just put the metal in here. Have I not leveled up yet? Golly, I can't just sit here and... Oh, I got... I, did I get a message? Wow, I really... My mind is really going, going bonker crazies on me. Crazy bonkers. Oh. Let's just let's just get the rest of this metal and then move on with our lives, huh? Huh? Gosh, I'm so far away from leveling up still. You know what I would like to do though, real quick, is I've been thinking about doing this uh, this like new video series where either at the end of every month or the end of every week. I'm not sure yet. Um, I'd like to do one or the other, but I thought it would be fun to do like a update video um or maybe not an update video per se see i'm not i'm not really sure of what i'm thinking with this so i'm just gonna kind of talk uh to you guys and maybe you can help me flesh out my thoughts a little bit um but what i was thinking is that it would be cool to do a video where we do like a a recap of everything that's gone on the channel that week um where maybe we highlight a couple videos that we really enjoyed um and then we also read through some of your guys' comments. Like we pick out a couple comments from each video or just from throughout the week and highlight them uh, and read them on camera, give you guys a shout out, and then potentially um, showcase any fan art that you guys have. Um, or, yeah, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Just kind of thinking, thinking out loud here. I think that'd be kind of neat. I would like to involve you guys in the actual videos a little bit more. And by doing something with 
your comments or your art and making an actual video out of it. And I'd like to give a verbal shout out uh, to everybody who's a member of the channel, um, which I believe right now it's Luke and Lisa. Uh, thank you guys so much for supporting the channel. Um, so what they do is they actually pay, I think it's like five bucks a month, somewhere around there. Um, and it actually helps really support the channel. Um, and they get special icons next to their name. Uh, and they get free shipping on all of our merchandise, which a lot of you guys are like, why do you have merchandise? And the answer is yes. It's linked at the end of every single video if you want to check that out. Um, but yeah, I would like to find another way to just reward the people who, who do that as well. And so by giving them shout outs every, every month that they're supporting, that would be kind of cool maybe. So I don't know. What would you guys like to see or how would you like to be involved in a video in that way? Um, would reading your comments be cool? Would showing your guys' art or something like that, would that be something you're interested in? Post in the comments. Let me know kind of what you're thinking because I would love to, um, to just include you guys in some way, shape, or form. I think that would be a lot of fun. Um, and, yeah, I'd, I'd love to do that. But I think I'm going to wrap up this episode here. Um, I'm just gonna throw the rest of the metal in there throw some stones a little bit of a grindy episode But that's okay next episode. We're probably going to be getting the workbench the, the thing that we can make is it called the workbench? I don't know. I just refer to it as the thing that allows me to make the metal thingies So probably gonna get that next episode, which will be marvelous and we'll make our metal tools what is this level episode four or five and we're already gonna be getting metal tools this is bomb we are killing it and then one by one we're gonna go and get oh yeah there it is let's just let's just oh my gosh we are killing it okay let's upgrade our carry weight and let's just scroll oh, there's so much stuff up here that i still need to get but i'm just i'm prioritizing all right i'm prioritizing uh, we can only get one at a time. But we got to get the forge. That's more important because we have to melt down the iron ingots. Uh, and then that's the trank darts so that we can go tame some stuff. Oh, man. This is going so good. It's going so good. And one by one, like I was saying, we're going to go and get all of the artifacts. And then once we get all the artifacts, we're going to challenge the bosses. Then once we beat the bosses, we're going to move on to a new map. I'm having a great time. I hope you guys are enjoying the series, and I hope you have a wonderful day, and I will see all of you beautiful people on the flip side.